welcome to tonight's webinar with myself, Nikki Jensen, and Artemis Kazane. I'm so excited. We're talking about one of my favorite things, essential oils, baby. Woohoo! Frankincense. Bam. Okay. Oh, of course, you have to show me up with six of them. <laughs> here. I have them all right here. Well, this is... Woohoo! But yes, I have my essential oils going on right here. See? Awesome. I'm excited. We have a lot of people coming in, and I just want to say bear with me if I am going in and unmuting, or, or I'm sorry, muting people and muting uh, their videos. So if you don't want to be um, on the video, go ahead and mute your video and so you won't be able to be seen. So if you're in your underwear, probably not a good thing to uh, have your video on, just an FYI. I've been going through and just trying to mute people's video, but sometimes people pop up. <laughs> so go ahead, oh, sorry. I muted mine instead of other people's. Um, go ahead and mute your video. So if you don't know who I am, my name is Nikki Jensen. And let me just tell you a little bit about who I am and what I do. Uh, for one, I am a certified holistic health coach. I help people with losing weight and taking a mind, body, and spirit approach. I am the creator and founder of a, a school called Women's Wellness Academy. You could check that out at Women Wellness Academy. Dot com. It's an awesome school. I created it. And um, I also have been doing for the last two years uh, telesummits, which is called Mega Wellness Summit. It just happened in March. Um, Artemis was featured twice on the summit. We had, what, 35 experts that I interviewed in March. It was a three week <laughs> long, awesome. Uh, journey summit it was great uh, you could check that out at mega wellness summit.com but tonight it isn't about me it is about essential oils and our teacher our wonderful teacher Artemis Kassane and so my friend Artemis who I am so grateful and honored to know let me just announce all the things that he does so for one he is a visionary entrepreneur, author, public speaker, and he is the creator of Juicing for Fat Loss, Elevate Your Life, and Green Living with Essential Oils. He specializes in, of course, essential oils, women's health, which him and his wife both uh, did teach a class for Women's Wellness Academy. It was awesome. Um, he does, he specializes in family health care, conscious language, tapping. He also did a class on um, EFT for Mega Wellness Summit, which was awesome. Advanced detoxification, and trust me, there are plenty more that he knows about. So he has been studying health for over 15 years, training extensively with highly well-known doctors, including Dr. Gabriel Cousins at the Tree of Life of Re um, Rejuvenation Center. I always botched that name up for whatever reason. Uh, he created uh, an advanced detoxification and emotional release techniques to heal and uplift thousands of people who are visiting the Tree of Life. So awesome. So Artemis is one heck of an extraordinary man. And I really, really can't wait to dive in tonight's class. Hello, Artemis. Hello, Nikki. I'm so excited to be here. I've got so many things to share. I mean, look at all these colorful bottles here. We're going to talk about the three top ways to use essential oils. We're going to talk about our recipes we sent out. Our viewers got some bonus recipes and the healing properties of those foods and, and essential oils coming together to nourish the body. Uh, we're going to get into family health care. There's just so much good stuff we're going to share tonight. So I'm excited to be here. I am very excited that you are here too. Hey, let's start with those... Um the giveaway, the gift that we uh, that we gave out that everyone should be should have in their inboxes, the little ebook. 
Yes, so in your bonus ebook, we gave you three essential oil infused recipes. One was the blueberry mango yum smoothie. The second one was the vanilla orange papaya pudding with vanilla bean and orange essential oil, delicious. And then the third one was a creamy dill uh, energy soup. And so the first two recipes you use in the morning for a high raw, high enzyme nutrient infusion. And then the third recipe you can do for lunch or dinner. Um, and it goes great with the salad or, or a, 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 like a, a piece of fish or a little bit of um, greens and sauerkraut. Just enjoy the energy soup for lunch or dinner. The first two recipes are enhanced with the citrus oils. So we want to talk first about lemon oil and citrus fresh um, in the, in, and also orange oil. So all the citrus oils are high in D-limonene and they're also going to boost liver gallbladder function. The citrus oils stimulate liver gallbladder, increasing glutathione production, which is detoxification in the body. The citrus oils build our immune system and lymphatic system. And the citrus oils also are natural antioxidant for reducing free radicals and promoting longevity and anti-aging. So all that's just in lemon, lime, and orange and citrus fresh. So when you do your, your blueberry mango yum smoothie, you're going to add about you know three drops of orange or three drops of citrus fresh. And a lot of the citrus oils are interchangeable too. And when you add the essential oil to a morning smoothie, the essential oils are getting more antioxidants, better digestion of your, of your proteins and fats, and immune boost. And so that's where like the essential oil component really comes in and supercharges your smoothies. And of course, the vanilla papaya pudding, I mean, that's like dessert. It's so delicious. Um, and it's you just make sure that when you're making that pudding, that you're ripening the papaya in the sun and you're getting it soft like an av like, like a ripe avocado. You want that papaya really ripe and soft. You don't want to buy it with any brown spots or any, you know, dark colorations or mold. You want to get a good Mexico or Central American papaya. Get it ripe, blend it in your Cuisinart with the S-Blade, and then add your vanilla bean and your three drops of orange or three drops of citrus fresh. And then you can sprinkle a little bit of like chia seed or chia powder if you need a little bit of fiber. Um, you can also sprinkle a little bit of bee pollen on it. I love it with bee pollen for energy. Um, and that vanilla butt pie pudding is delicious. So I wanted to you know, give a shout out to all the recipes we have because they're delicious and they're great um, raw high energy breakfasts infused with essential oils. I agree. I agree that they're amazing. And I have been doing, um, excuse me, more, I was telling you this earlier, I've been doing more fruit in the morning. So I, I was really afraid of fruit because I do paleo. And so you have convinced me otherwise to do more fruit because it's so hydrating. And I have watched videos uh, with other people saying the same thing, do fruit, it's so hydrating. And what I realize is that my body is very much dehydrated. And that's why I wasn't feeling very well. So once I started the fruit and the structured water, and then with the fruit, it, it's already, it's like having structured water right there because the fruit's structuring it for you. And so I've been doing um, lots of melons, papaya in the morning. And I also, this is very big. You uh, putting the papaya seeds in my smoothies for anti candida. Yes. And it's been, it's been wonderful. My gut is, I would say 99% healed. Cause I don't know about the 1%, but I feel amazing. I really yes. do. So I, I really appreciate um, all of your wisdom because it's been very b beneficial for me. Absolutely. Congratulations. Well, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate that. So let's go ahead and we have a really a filled hour here and might even go over a little bit um, over an hour. So bear with us because we have a lot of ground to cover here. But the first thing that we're going to talk about is, you know, why not, why all essential oils are not safe, not safe. That surprises me. 
Yes, and the, I'm going to touch on a little bit about quality control and, and how it's important to know your source, know the integrity of the company you're working with and why we teach Young Living Essential Oils for this powerful healing properties that the Young Living Seek to Seal Essential Oils provide us. And we're also going to go into how to properly use the oils and talk about topical internal use and direct inhalation and really demonstrate a lot of those here in class tonight. And we're gonna share uh, some really simple and easy ways to build up your medicine cabinet with boosting your digestion, boosting your immunity, encapsulation of essential oils, and how to encapsulate properly and take your oils properly. And we're gonna be teaching a lot of oils from the premium starter kit. Uh, this is what you get when you're ready to get your essential oils with Nikki and Artemis. You're gonna get this kit in the mail and it's gonna have 10, actually, excuse me, 11 bottles of essential oils inside. So you're gonna have this amazing premium starter kit with all these yummy oils. And so a lot of the oils we're teaching tonight, you can get in the kit and start using right away. Um, and then we'll also touch on a little bit of family healthcare because you have kids. I have a new baby boy that was just born um, last January 15th and his name is Orion and we have so many fun real-time powerful stories to share about our kiddos and families. Yeah, and I have a 10-year-old and a 6-year-old, so mine are definitely not new. But I wish that I would have known a lot of this when I was a new mom because it's been, um, you know, if I, if I knew what Artemis knew, being a, a new dad, I probably would, you know, I... I don't know. I would make, I would have made a lot of different choices. My kids are very, very healthy, but at the same time, uh, it's good to know, you know, you healed or you've helped your son with teething and you helped your, I mean, I had to go to the hospital when I had mastitis and you were just telling me about your wife that you healed mastitis naturally. Mm -hmm. And so how did you do that? So, um, we used an oil called Thebes. Um, okay. And this essential oil is a blend of clove, cinnamon, eucalyptus, rosemary, um, and let's see, clove, cinnamon, eucalyptus, rosemary, and lemon. There's five essential oils in Thebes. And so my wife, you know, being brand new to breastfeeding, she didn't understand the importance of keeping him on the boob and mm -hmm. keeping the milk flowing. And then she got an infection. The midwife came over immediately and they, she brought a breast pump. And then after she pumped out the, the milk, we covered about five drops of thieves on, on both breasts. We covered it with a little bit of castor oil, and then we put a hot, wet compress. Um, and in 24 hours, she was, the, the inflammation was gone, the mastitis was gone, and she was completely better. Um, no antibiotics, no nothing, no medications, which is very dangerous to give a new mother antibiotics when she's breastfeeding because you want all that beneficial bacteria in the body and in the milk. So we were able to use a, a natural remedy, essential oils, rather than the medications. And, and this is really why I'm here today teaching all this information because I've got 15 years, three clinics, 10,000 people served, you know, in, and I, I, I'm ready to give a, a new system of healthcare to our world and to our moms and families um, and dads, too, who are ready to jump in. It's like we, we have this amazing pharmacy called Essential Oils that can, can solve so many of our challenges. Exactly. Yeah, and I, I ended up going um, on antibiotics. I was in the hospital, and it was, um, it was terrible. So I wish that I would have known what I know today back then. But, again, you can't go back in time. You can only move forward. And I can teach my children – the proper way of doing things so they can do that for their children. So our children are really our future. They're just kind of, you know, we're making mistakes and correcting our yeah. mistakes and teaching them how to do better. And that's the only thing that we can do. Once we know better, we do better. Yeah, we're really paying it forward. Like all the moms and families that get this information right now and the children that are raised this way, take it into their future generations and we change the whole paradigm. So this is how we change the medical paradigm of treatment and surgeries to solutions and, and cure. And there are th three basic ways we can use essential oils. I want to dive in and talk about the top three uses. And one of the best ways to use essential oils 
is make essential oil waters with lemon or peppermint. So you have the internal use of essential oil waters, and I'll get into that in a little bit. The number two way is topical application of essential oils. And the topical application can also be uh, used with the vegetable oil like the V6 massage oil. And you can apply the essential oils along the spine, the lower back, the feet, and then follow with the massage oil. Number three is direct inhalation. And this is like the no-brainer. This is like the easy way. You just get an essential oil diffuser. You are, yep, exactly. You just put eight drops of your essential oil in the diffuser. Best time to use your diffuser is first thing in the morning when you're waking up or right before bed. And for those of you who have sleep issues, anxiety, fear, stress, worry, get your lavender in the diffuser, get your stress away in the diffuser that comes in your kit, and start breathing in the essential oils. And I'll start with the aromatic use. And so we have the internal use, the topical use, and the aromatic use. And um, remind me, Nikki, to also talk about why all oils are not safe because we're going to address that right after this because um, I jumped into the top three uses. So the aromatic use, the olfactory sense of our nose initiates our most powerful emotional response. There are over a thousand nerve endings right at the bridge of our nose called olfactory nerves that directly connect to the center of our brain, which is the hypothalamus, that's where the pituitary and pineal gland are that regulate all hormonal systems of the body. So this is like your CPU. This is where everything in your body is controlled and regulated. And our sense of smell of the five senses is the only sense that can directly stimulate the hypothalamus and bring balance and healing to the hypothalamus. So when we're feeling worry, anxiety, fatigue, when we feel emotionally stuck, we can start breathing in the essential oils. And just by breathing them in, they can help the hypothalamus heal and, uh, and create this cascade throughout the entire hormone system of the body and also help us even express emotion, like suppressed emotions can be released. So just breathing the essential oils in is magical. I'll share something with you I do every day. I get up in the morning, I drink a, a, a liter of structured water or I eat some melon for hydration. And then I sit down and I pray and meditate. I start every morning in silence. I don't go to my smartphone. I don't go to my computer. I don't go to the television. All technology off. I start in prayer and essential oils. And I breathe the essential oils in. As I apply them to my body, I'm breathing them in. And I set the tone for my day in prayer, meditation, and essential oils. And that creates a beautiful day. Just doing that every morning with your oils and setting that tone of presence and then being able to activate your, your hypothalamus, your emotional brain, and being able to stimulate and balance all your energy centers just through your smell is amazing. And then I'll, oh, another thing I'm doing with the essential oils is I'm applying them topically. So I'll put them on my navel, solar plexus, heart, thyroid, brain, crown. These are all the endocrine glands. And so I kind of like tune up my body with, you know, frankincense or stress away or frankincense and cedarwood is a magic combination. These two oils, some of my favorite oils for meditation and prayer, frankincense and cedarwood. And I'll put these oils and, I'll, and as I'm applying them topically, the topical use of essential oils improves circulation it helps promote oxygenation. It helps promote better skin, more youthful skin. And the topical use can also help with temporary discomfort, aches, aches in the joints and the muscles and the tendons. And so using the oils topically is powerful because essential oils don't require digestion. They go right into your tissues, giving you immediate relief. And that's immediate emotional balance or immediate relief in the joints, tendons, and muscles. So we have the topical use of oils to really penetrate the body and give your body that really great sense of, ah, you know, balance and well-being. And for my son, Orion, uh, we do uh, a shower in the evening as a family together. And when he gets out of the shower, I've got cedarwood and stress away. I'm using um, this blend, stress away, and cedarwood. And I'm rubbing the oils in his spine. I'm rubbing some on his feet. 
and that just puts him to sleep literally like a baby. I mean, he just goes to bed so easily. And if you're a parent, you know how sometimes getting your kids to wind down can be really challenging. And the topical use of the oils for my son is magic. It's just it's so effective. The internal use of essential oils is going to be primarily in your smoothies, like we talked about, the blueberry mango or any fruit smoothie. Add three drops of lemon, three drops of orange, three drops of citrus fresh. Try that. You can also make essential oil waters. And I want to highlight the importance of using glass when you're making your essential oil waters. The reason you want to use glass is because essential oils dissolve plastic. And so you don't want to be putting essential oils in plastic water bottles or plastic cups. You want to be using glass containers um, or like just, you know, a 24 ounce mason jar. Like this is a cherry elixir I drink at bedtime. So you, essential oil waters are going to improve your digestion. They're going to help um, improve your immune system. They're going to help improve circulation in your lymphatic system. So you just start with a couple drops of lemon, lemon oil, in your water in the morning, it's gently cleansing the liver and gallbladder. Lemon oil also powerfully boosts the immune system. In France, as lemon oil has been used for 30 years for cold and flu. So you can use the lemon oil to powerfully boost your immune system every day and keep your immune system really strong. Another thing that lemon oil is really good for is dissolving fat. So it's, it's actually a good weight loss oil too to help the body clear excess cholesterol and fat because the lemon actually dissolves fat and a little DIY tip if you have a stain in your shirt or gum in your carpet or oil oil stain 10 drops of lemon takes it right out because it cuts through grease grime and fat um, I also use lemon oil in my um, my in my laundry when I'm doing a, a wash of clothes six drops in your laundry and they come out smelling like a lemon grove so your lemon oil is great in water. Another oil you can use in your water is peppermint. Now, peppermint essential oil helps with bloating, nausea, and occasional digestive discomfort. Peppermint's also great for energy. So when you're drinking your peppermint in the morning, it helps clear brain fog. And so, like I was driving in the car today back from a, a healing treatment. I got a treatment from my, one of my colleagues, Dr. David Weinthal. And I was starting to get a little brain fog from the from the, the treatment. Actually, it was healing me. So I put four drops of peppermint on my neck, four drops here, four drops here, and I just rubbed it in, and that cleared my head immediately. And then another step after a topical use of peppermint would be to drink a drop. Now, peppermint is a strong essential oil, and it's also considered a hot essential oil. So you only need a drop to get the energy boost and the digestive boost. When you're putting peppermint on topically, you may also choose to dilute with the massage oil. And this is the V6 uh, Young Living Massage Oil. And there are some oils that when we heal and seal with the vegetable oil, it slows down the absorption of the essential oil so that it lasts longer in the body. Essential oils are volatile aromatic compounds, and so they can diffuse off the body. So when we're putting oils on for muscles, tendons, ligaments, lower back, feet are a great magic place for the oils. We want to heal and seal with a good massage oil, and that will slow down the absorption. So if you're working with yourself or a family member and the oil gets too intense, remember to immediately follow with a massage oil. Um, and... I'll highlight the oils in the kit that are hot oils. You get 11 bottles in the kit, and the oils that are considered hot, they need to be diluted, is peppermint and thieves, and um, that's it. Peppermint and thieves. Oh, and purification. Purification is the third oil that would be considered a hot oil. Also, too, when we're diluting, we're not talking about diluting with, and cutting it with water, are we? No, no, we want to dilute with a, a vegetable oil like the V6 massage oil or coconut oil from your cabinet. You want to dilute with the fatty oil because essential oils and water do not mix. So water drives them in deeper. Fatty acids or vegetable fats slow down the absorption. So like when you're working with boosting the immune system topically, let's say you want to put some oils on your feet 
you could put, you know, five drops of thieves in the left and right foot, and then you can immediately follow with a little bit of carrier oil to dilute. Let's say you want to, uh, you know, improve circulation in the spine and the joints. You want to help, you know, relieve occasional discomfort. The Panaway oil that comes in the kit, you would put this on immediately undiluted, and you follow with a vegetable oil to heal and steal. And so always use a vegetable oil. Awesome. Now, yeah. how come we're not going to, you know, regular like Whole Foods and buying essential oils? Is can we do that, or is that the what we're talking about here as far as essential oils not being so safe when we do that? Yeah, what's interesting about essential oils is that we have so many choices now in the marketplace. You know, Amazon, Whole Foods, your health food store, you know, doTERRA, Young Living, and Mayo. And the reason I teach Young Living essential oils, and I've been with Young Living for 15 years. I used to get tapes. Do you remember tapes? Oh, my yeah. Meal? I used to get training tapes from Young Living teaching me the farming practices, the proper seed selection, the cultivation of the plants, how the plants are harvested, how they're distilled. And this is actually a Young Living standard that makes Young Living oils the highest quality in the world. And I'll do a, just a quick screen share and show you what the standard is called. It's called Seed to Seal. So the reason I teach Young Living for internal use, for topical use, and for inhalation to raise our health care, to raise our family's well-being, is because of this seed to seal standard. And so Young Living has 20 years in the industry. Young Living is actually the largest manufacturer and distributor of essential oils, producing the oils with the right quality of seed selection, getting the most potent plant, and then growing the plant properly, cultivating the oil correctly, and state-of-the-art all stainless steel distillation. Every Young Living distillery is free of all plastics and copper. And a lot of other distilleries you buy from, they cut corners. And some of the corners they cut is in the distillation where they're actually not using all stainless steel. Whereas Gary Young and the, and the owners of Young Living, they go to great measures to build an all stainless steel operation so it's non-toxic, non-caustic, non-leaching, pure stainless steel distillation. And then testing is very important. And this is why we don't buy essential oils at Whole Foods for internal use or Amazon. You want to get your Young Living Wholesome membership because you know that when you buy a Young Living oil, it goes through eight laboratory tests. And these tests are ensure that there's no adulteration. The challenge and opportunity we have in the essential oil industry, and I've been in the industry for 15 years, so I have, a, I have a much broader perspective than most people you'll talk to. The challenge is there's more hype than substance when it comes to essential oils these days. You don't necessarily know what you're getting, even if you're buying from these reputable companies. And what makes Young Living the world leader and so powerful is 20 years of farming, 20 years of lab testing, building the largest database of labs and farms, producing the highest quality plants, testing oh, year after year, and giving all of our families this quality. No other company in the world has come even close to doing that like Young Living has. And so what we have in the marketplace is a lot of people pushing organic, you know, certified oils, you know, indigenously sourced. But this doesn't mean it's the right quality because there's so many ways adulteration can come in. Lavender is adulterated. There's 1,200% more lavender sold in the market than grown. And so what does that tell you? A lot of lavender is cut with adulterants that are odorless and tasteless, but they actually do this to make more money. And the reason we're teaching Young Living with the seed to seal standard is because of all those things I taught you, the, the right seed, the right cultivation, distillation, testing, and bottling. This ensures that when Nikki or, or me teaches you how to use an oil, you know it's safe. You know it's good for topical and internal use. 
when you go to the health food store, all the bottles will say not for internal use. But yet Young Living Oils puts supplement on their bottle. The oils that are safe for use actually say supplement. And so that's how you can tell Young Living is a step above all the other companies. I see. It's very uh, cool for me because um, using essential oils is actually very new for me. Um, it's probably in the last two years that I really have been using them, but it wasn't until I met you that I really understood how to use them. So I, I never really had a diffuser. I wasn't really sure, um, you know, how to apply them or why or when I would have applied them. The only one I really was familiar with was, um, Mel, you know, Melaleuca and um, lavender. And so, you know, I would just use tea tree oil and lavender in my child in my kids' baths, or um, may maybe even peppermint. But I wasn't even sure what to do with peppermint. So it's great to understand the uses and what we're using them for. And so, and every day I learn something more. Seriously, because um, just talking to you, your world of wisdom, and it's it's really great. You know, the thing that's really cool is when you sign up, right, and you buy the package, the starter kit, is that everyone gets 30 minutes with you. A per like a personal invitation to chat with you one on one on how to use the oils. Yeah, so we have a really special offer for anyone who's ready to get you know, their essential oil medicine cabinet and their, their new healthcare system with the premium starter kit. They get a 30 minute complimentary coaching session with me that they schedule digitally online. It's really easy, you just click on the calendar, you find your time slot, and you get to work with me over the phone or over video chat. For those who are technologically savvy, you can work with me through video or phone, and I'll walk you step by step through your home pharmacy and get you started right. And the reason I do this, Nikki, is because it's important that we get educated and that we get all our questions asked and answered from the beginning. Mm -hmm. Because there's so many things that fall through the cracks. So many times people get their kit and just collects dust on their shelf. So I don't want that to happen with anyone watching tonight. I'm going to give you 30 minutes of my time which is about $150. I, I'm a, I charge $250 an hour in my private coaching practice. So you get, you get me supporting you, walking you through stuff, every step of the way. And I'm also going to share with you our 21-day online e-course. And this 21-day training was put together by my partner, Peter uh, Craig and I. And we have an amazing 21 days. It's three emails a week, 10, 10 minutes a day a live video training teaching you every oil in the kit. So if you miss some things in today's webinar and you wanna go deeper and learn more about internal topical inhalation, it's all in the e-course. And everyone who joins and gets their kit also gets the e-course and I'll share that with you right now. It's a really amazing um, creation. I'm really proud of this because our e-course teaching every oil in the premium starter kit over 21 days is another way I can help people and particularly women and families get all of their questions answered because the e-course gives you this little drip of Artemis and Peter training. You just get a little e email every other day teaching you lavender, lemon, peppermint, frankincense, thieves, purification, stress away, ningxia red, in the e-course, we also go over the essential oil desk reference. And this book teaches, this is basically all the only book you ever need on essential oils. I gotta mail you a copy of this. Remind me to put one of these in the mail for you because this is so, so valuable for your family, healthcare. And in chapter 20, personal usage, this is gonna teach you a lot of the things I touched on in today's webinar. But we have a video, um, teaching the, the, this e-course, and I'm turning to the chapter right now. It's one of my favorite chapters in the book, and the reason I'm highlighting it is because it's the personal usage directory. And so we teach chapter 20 
in the e-course and why you should look at all the safe and effective ways to use your oils. And so that e-course is a great value. Wow. That is, it is a great value. And it's being given away. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's so, amazing. That's so a we, great, that's a great way to, for, I, I think it's brilliant bonuses because for one, you have to learn how to use them. I was the person that let them sit there. And, you know, I was gifted um, essential oils by a good friend. And, um, but I wasn't gifted the opportunity to learn about them. So I would ask, I would be in these Facebook groups and I, I didn't want to ask or look stupid or anything like, how do I use these? I'm not exactly sure what to do. But I just, um, in, really, by talking with you, that's how I understood how to use them. And so now I use them every single day. And when my, when, this was the test, my daughter would always, um, not always, but she would get um, just like little colds. And so she'd have a lot of mucus and um, I don't know how to describe it, but anyways, just little colds, runny mm -hmm. nose, and she'd have like these double lips. You know how kids get those double lips and they're constantly licking their lips? So she gets that. So I put a diffuser in her room and every single night she goes to bed with lavender and I believe it's uh, eucalyptus and what I have the, um, the other one in there, the one thieves. I have thieves in there. So what thieves did is it made her better literally overnight. I, I can't explain that, but I used it and I know that it works. She's inhaling the thieves and it's, it's like killing the virus. Also, sometimes I use lemon in there too. Yeah, the reason it worked overnight is because of that small molecular size, every essential oil when it's properly harvested and distilled has a very small molecular size. It goes right into her lungs and bloodstream and it starts to support the healing of her body immediately. So it's, that's the beauty of, it, of just adding essential oils to your healthcare system is that they're really a wonderful quick fix and to a lot of uh, health challenges we experience today like bloating, nausea, immunity, digestion, poor circulation, inflammation. There's so many ways we can incorporate the oils and get a lot out of them very quickly. I mean, then, go to the doctor at my house. So this, is, this has to work. <laughs> and that's, and that's, why, that's also why we created the 21 day e-course. Um, and so I want, did want to share the link to everyone if they want to get started. It's bit.ly, B-I-T dot L-Y forward slash join with Nikki J. N-I-K-K-I-J. Bit.ly join with Nikki J. So that's the link when you're ready to get started. As soon as you uh, activate your membership, I will get a notice and I will send you the link for your 30 minute coaching session. The second email you're going to get is the email for the e-course to log in. And the e-course, we didn't mention this, but it's $197 value um, for the 21-day e-course because it's it's an extensive training in essential oil healthcare for your for yourself and your whole family. So you get both of those bonuses right away as soon as you activate your kit. Um, I'll share a story with you about my son Orion. Um, when when he started to really teeth, you know, there was all, you know, fee, intermittent fevers, there was lots of crying, there was lots of pain, inflammation. And we used an oil in the kit called Copa Iba. Um, and this is one of the 11 oils you get in the starter kit. And when we used the Copa Iba, we would take just a drop and put it right on the gum. And Copa Iba has a, a compound in it called beta caryophyllene. Um, and that's a fancy term for it helps numb and reduce pain. So we just use the Kofi Uritis gum and then we would take some of the, uh, the lavender Kofi Iba and we just massage it on his jawline like right here. And it, within literally seconds, he would stop crying and be totally fine. And then every time there's a bug bite or a bump or a cut or a scrape, we go to purification in the kit. 
And purification is a great skin cleanser. It's great for bug bites and, and bumps. And then, of course, lavender. Lavender is a magical oil um, for anxiety and worry and fear. And you can put the lavender on topically. And I use um, another oil for my son at Ryan right before he goes to bed, stress away. Now, this one has vanilla in it. The aroma of stress away is rich, calming, soothing, exotic. It has cedarwood, lavender, um, lime, vanilla, and okatea. And these five oils in stress away are both calming and balancing, and they're great for occasional discomfort, aches and pains in the body. And the stress away also comes in the starter kit. And then I have this ritual every night, and you do too, and I want to talk about sleep because one of the best ways and one of the most powerful healing properties of our essential oils is to improve the quality of our sleep. So many of us are not getting good sleep these days because of electronics, adrenal fatigue, nutrient deficiencies, mineral deficiencies. And while you're moving into a healthier lifestyle, what I encourage you to do is – Every night before you go to bed, I want to teach you a sleep ritual and sleep like a baby protocol. And it's these two oils, your lavender and cedarwood. And if you like, you can add the cedarwood to your first order because it's only like $11, $12 a bottle. And it's a very effective oil for promoting pineal and pituitary health. So cedarwood is high in cedral. And it's also rich in compounds called sesquiterpenols. And these essential oil compounds in cedarwood can pass the blood brain barrier and to help support healthy pineal gland, which produces melatonin. So when you're applying the cedarwood to the neck and the head, it's actually oxygenating the brain. And then the aroma of cedarwood, remember the aromatic influence, is calming the nervous system. Lavender, of course, is the Swiss Army knife, and it's also calming and soothing. So your sleep like a baby protocol is to take three drops lavender in the left palm, three drops cedarwood. You want to mix these together, and you're creating a little sleep infusion here, and then you're going to start rubbing the oils on the ears. And I'll tell you why in a sec. And then after you rub the oils in the ears, you're going to put the oils right at the neck, towards the base of your skull so you can get the oils circulating into the bloodstream, into the brain. And then you're gonna take the rest and just kind of rub it on your face, on the scalp. You're gonna breathe it in, three deep breaths. And I promise you, if you do that every night at about 9 p.m. or 9.30, if you do it every night for 21 nights, you will see a dramatic shift in how you feel the next day because of proper neurological balance, but going from sympathetic to parasympathetic and do that, you're moving deeper into a relaxation response through breathing the oils in. And then you're also getting that topical infusion of the essential oil molecules into the brain, which is promoting hypothalamus and pineal gland. And the pineal gland produces melatonin. So you may see an increase in your hypothalamus function and your healthy uh, sleep cycle. So it's the topical and aromatic use every night of lavender and cedarwood. And I have testimonials on this protocol. Like you go to my YouTube channel and you'll see people like, wow, I've tried so many things and this worked for me. And I hear that dozens and dozens of times with my clients and my students is that the lavender and cedarwood. Now you can also try stress away in cedarwood. So just like I said, three drops lavender and cedarwood, you can do three drops of stress away, three drops cedarwood. If you want to take it to the next level, are you ready for this, Nikki? Are you ready I'm to take ready. it to the next level? Totally. Okay. So the next level of essential oil health care, and I'm pulling out my, my essential oil desk reference here. Is that by Liv Young Living? No, this is a third-party publisher. Uh, Young Living as a manufacturer is actually not allowed to teach how to use their product. That's the okay. FDA laws. Uh, so it's a third-party publisher called Life Science Publishers, and it's a central oil desk reference. And I'm going to turn to the yellow section in the book, and this section is gives you the, the, the charts of the anatomy and physiology. So I'm turning 
to um, chapter 15, Techniques for Essential Oil Application. Here is the chart for the ears. Look at all those points. Wow. So this is why I say start with, crazy. The, start with the ears with cedarwood and lavender and then move to the neck and the scalp and then breathe it in. And then you're infusing your body with oxygen, frequency, and energy, balancing all systems of the body through the ears because the air is a hologram for the entire body. Also balancing the body through the nose. Taking it to the next level is the bottoms of the feet. So we know in reflexology that there are 72,000 nerve endings that terminate in the feet. And when we rub oils in the feet, we get a two-fold healing response. One, it feels good. It's good, to get, it's good to rub your own feet or have your foot rubbed. Because the foot is like a, is like a sponge. Yes. And two, the oil is absorbed through the feet because the largest pores in our body are in our feet. And there's a reason for that. When we're walking outside barefoot, we want to breathe in that morning dew of the morning. We want to take in the earth energy and the morning dew when we're walking barefoot. The, the pores on our feet literally drink in the healing properties of nature. And remember, essential oils have small molecular size, high oxygen, high energy. So when we're rubbing oils in the feet, it's actually entering the bloodstream through these pores. And if we have a nice uh, helping hand to massage these reflex centers, we can take our seed blend in the lungs right here in the pads. We can use Digize or Thieves right here for the digestive system and support digestion. We can do lavender and stress away along the toes to support healthy brain and, and, and pineal and pituitary functions. So the feet are really a wonderful place to get into a daily flow or daily rhythm of using essential oils. And this, this you can get this chart on the internet for free. You just type in Vita Flex essential oil chart and you'll see this chart online. And the reason I bring the feet into the class tonight is because they're often overlooked. You know, we, we don't really consider the feet a, a logical or, or common sense place for essential oils. And yet, because they're entry points into the bloodstream and the lymphatic system, it's great to get oils in the feet. And I enjoy rubbing oils on my wife's feet you know, at least once a week, uh, right, right before bed. It's really a powerful healing. Can you repeat how to get that book? Uh-huh. Yeah, so it's Life Science Publishers. And, um, yeah, I see where I was looking at the chat here. Um, Life Science Publishers. And it's the Essential Oil Desk Reference 6th Edition. And you said you could get it for free? No, no, it's, you buy the book. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's not free. It, it's about it, somewhere between forty-five and sixty dollars, depending on they have sales. So it retails for fifty-nine ninety-nine. Got it. Yeah. Got it. Very cool. Now, if somebody does have uh, a lot of medications that they're on, you know, we're moving from you know um, a sick world. <laughs> It really is. It's a sick world right now that we're living in. Unfortunately, the healthcare system has failed us. And with people like um, Artemis and myself, that we believe that we're going to be shifting our par this paradigm that we're in into uh, really changing this into natural immunity, natural healing. That's the way to go. These medications are so toxic and harmful to our body, they are anti-life. So what I would recommend is that when you do get your oil kit to talk to Artemis for your 30 minute session with him, talk about the different uh, medications that you're on and talk about a plan on how to get yourself off. Because we can't go through all the different medications um, tonight on tonight's call. So honestly, I would really just sign up, get your oils, um, and really start moving into this different paradigm with us. It's really um, going to be essential to your life, and it will really improve so many things. So many things. I really cannot um, 
emphasize this enough because it has changed uh, my life on many different levels and my children's life. Uh, they, they love uh, when I rub their feet, when mm -hmm. I rub their ears. I mean, they literally, I, every single night I have to rub, <laughs> I have to rub their backs. And um, mm -hmm. a lot of the times I do um, a raindrop of lavender on their spine mm -hmm. just to calm their nervous system down. And so when, um, when they're really, you know, intense or they have something going on the next day, then, you know, we'll calm them down. I use lavender a lot with my children. So we're going to go and, and head, on, head on into really talking to mothers right now with how to use the essential oils on children. We've talked a lot mm -hmm. about that uh, throughout the call, but I really do want to hit home. For one, I get a lot of uh, kind of like caution or be buyer beware from people that I know. Just doing, having you on Mega Wellness Summit, I was getting lots of messages do not use essential oils on children and do not you do not um, take them internally so for one we've already said you can it's safe to use internally would you recommend using um well yes because you, you rub you rub essential oils on your son's gums natural mm -hmm. and safe he's fine he's living he's okay he's thriving right. yes yeah and they there are over 40 essential oils that are considered grass essential oils generally regarded as safe by the Food and Drug Administration. And essential oils have been used in candies and liqueurs for over 150 years. Essential oils have been used in our food supply longer than we've had regulation. So the internal use of essential oils with common sense, and I want to really bring this awareness to everyone who's watching it, particularly moms and families, is use common sense with kids such as dilute in fruit smoothies when you're putting oils in the body dilute with the vegetable oil children need less and dilution the most important thing you're focusing on though is the quality and the purity of the oil you're making sure that it's a pure high quality oil and then you know as long as it's pure and high quality and you're using common sense of course it's going to be great for your kids because essential oils are made of carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. They're just like herbs, they're just more concentrated. So because they're more concentrated, you wanna use common sense with kids and always dilute. And so when I'm putting oils on my son Orion, uh, with the exception of the teething, because that was to get immediate relief with the copaiba, but with his feet and spine, I often apply carrier oil, you know, and I heal and seal. When I'm rubbing oils in his feet, I'll put some lavender or stress away, and then I'll heal and seal with the vegetable oil. And you need less with kids. And because of the purity and potency of Young Living Seed to Seal, you know you're providing a pure, good quality, clean essential oil for your kiddos. So one of the, the, the most important things you're gonna do for kids is, is helping with calming um, hyperactivity, anxiety, and fear. Um, and so that's going to be in, in the premium starter kit, the kit that you get when you sign up. The oils you're going to be using are frankincense, lavender, and stress away. And so you can take a little bit of the frankincense or lavender, apply it on the heart, apply it on the spine. And when it comes to healing and sealing, the safest and gentlest oils are going to be the frankincense and the lavender oil. These are going to be the, the safest, gentlest oils that you can just put on and you don't really need to follow with the vegetable oil. Let's say you're going to put on uh, an oil for digestion. Uh, we have an oil in the starter kit called Digex. Uh, and this is a blend of tarragon, anise, patchouli, fennel, ginger, and lemon. And Digex helps with bloating, nausea, discomfort for our kiddos. Like if they eat too much or they eat too fast, when you put the digest on the belly, you want to follow with the vegetable oil. Um, you can also use digest on the feet, on the arches of the feet, like we showed you there, and do some deep pressure. 
and it's magic for our children to help with their digestion and immunity. Um, so we talked about anxiety with lavender and frankincense, heart, chest, talked about digize for digestion. Let's go into the citrus oils, lemon and citrus fresh. Get these oils in your kids' smoothies, get them in your chia porridge, get them in their fruit salads, get these oils in their body because and remember you're diluting them in the smoothie or the chia porridge or a little bit of the oatmeal. And when you're getting the oils in food, it's, it's mixing with the healthy proteins and fats. And yes, even fruit has fat. Fruits contain saturated and unsaturated fats. And so as you're blending in the essential oils of the smoothies for your kiddos, and you're giving them these supercharged smoothies, you're getting more antioxidants, more immune health, you're supporting healthy liver and gallbladder function. So that's going to help them, you know, stay strong in digestion and also stay strong in immunity. So get the citrus oils in their, in their meals. One drop is plenty. Um, if you're making a smoothie for two for mom and, and daughter, mom and son, you can do two or three drops. And that's just a little bit of a boost, you know, for your, your family health care. And also too, it's going to detoxify them. Mm -hmm. So in my case, because I have older children, 10 and six, um, especially for my 10 year old, because what happens with older children is sports. What happens after sports comes snacks by really these, um, and I don't mean to judge or anything, but somewhere along the line, um, somebody loses their mind and buys really horrid, horrid snacks, like all sugar, GMO nonsense. And so sometimes when I've lost my mind as well, um, you know, he'll eat um, something that isn't great for his body. And so what do you do? You give them the citrus essential oils to then I go ahead and um, and get hit, purify his purify that crap out of his body. <laughs> hey, uh, Nikki, we have a question from Lynn Farr. She says, "What does raindrop technique mean?" So, Lynn, the raindrop technique is the application of essential oils along the spine, like drops of rain. Um, and there actually is a raindrop technique Young Living created. I just did one last night uh, on a client and friend of mine, and it's just applying oils right onto the spine and then healing with the vegetable oil and doing some you know massage therapy techniques to help improve electrical balance and circulation and health of the spine and all of the nerves that flow down the spinal column um, to go back to your statement nikki it's true so many of our kids are not they're so toxic and they're, they're, they're toxic from from gluten dairy and gmos and so essential oils do help with detoxification yeah and especially if you have been following me um, for you know a few a couple of years now, you know that I talk a lot about glyphosate um, and what it does to the body, and that it's hard to get glyphosate out of the body. And the glyphosate is directly from GMO foods. So if we can get glyphosate out of the body with the help of essential oils. I think that's amazing. It's really, I think the only thing that I can think of that will truly detoxify and break down glyphosate, really. And you wanna get that stuff out of your, if you're a new mom um, and you're breastfeeding, you, most children, babies have glyphosate in their body because it's passed through um, in the womb and it's also passed through breast milk. So you wanna make sure that you're detoxifying this glyphosate because it's damaging so many um, areas of the body, especially the brain. And it has been linked to autism. Uh, Dr. Stephanie Seneff is another uh, researcher scientist from MIT who I have had the privilege to uh, interview twice now. And you know, she has mentioned that we're going down a really, really deep, dark path with GMOs. So if, if we can solve that problem with essential oils, 
then I'm on that train. And I'm all about that. So I, under, I know where you're going with this, Artemis, with this balloon. I have a balloon. I've this before. This is so cool. So we're talking about detoxification of the body and removing chemicals, gly glycophosphate, things like that. The citrus essential oils are nature's cleansers, and that has to do with the antioxidant property of citrus through limonene. Citrus oils are solvents. Solvent means to dissolve fats. A lot of these chemicals, like heavy metals, parasites, and, and phosphates, are fat-soluble toxins. It's what the citrus oils can do is they can cut through the fat soluble toxins and carry them out. This is a balloon. It's made of rubber. So we're going to pretend like this is a toxin that's trapped in the body. And we're going to put the citrus oil on top and it pops the balloon. And that demonstrates live in real time how essential oils can detoxify our cells is because this essential oils are fat soluble. A lot of the nutrients we bring into the body, like our, our juices, vegetables, and fruits, are water-soluble nutrients. But the problem with a lot of our toxins in our children is that they're fat-soluble. They get trapped in the fat or inside the cell. Essential oils cross the cell membrane, and they can either deliver nutrients into the cell or expel toxins from the cell. Um, and we should probably do a whole webinar in the future just on cleansing with essential oils for the family. And, be next. I, and, and, and I was thinking also a, a, like a webinar on total body solutions for women's health and hormone balance. I mean, there's so much we can teach. So how about we send out a survey and see what they want to learn because we can teach more of this stuff. I love it. I'll get on top of that. Yeah. One question for you um, that I'm a little bit confused on myself when I, uh, re when I receive the kit is what does RC do? <laughs> RC stands for respiratory care, and it's going to help. Uh, it's going to be a vasodilator. It's going to increase oxygenation and circulation to the lungs. It has powerful oils for boosting the immune system for that change of season or cold and flu season. So you want to diffuse RC during the fall and winter. You want to put it on top of the lungs to improve respiration and oxygenation. For athletes out there, for people who are into fitness, RC, I get up in the morning and I put RC right here on my lungs and I do tapping techniques. And it's and I love the way the essential oils oxygenate, energize my morning fitness. And so it's a great oil for fitness as well. I love this. Okay, so I just had an aha moment because of the fact that we have these amazing lines in our sky now. I'm sure that you have noticed those. You mean Kim Trails? Yes, I mean, I interviewed Dane Wigington from geoengineeringwatch.org. It was a fascinating interview because he goes into, and you should just check it out for yourself if you have no idea what I'm talking about right now. Like, Nikki, you're totally crazy. <laughs> All you have to do is really look up, and you're going to see a whole bunch of lines in the sky. Those lines in the sky are toxic. And they're filled with toxic chemicals that we're breathing in. So and heavy metals. Fantastic that I just figured out what RC meant that can combat chemtrails. Yeah, and that's why, you know, why I love teaching the essential oil lifestyle. When you join Young Living and you get your premium starter kit, you get a free diffuser, and you have instantly a way to get the oils internally, topically through direct inhalation. And we really like making a lifestyle. We like teaching people the essential oil lifestyle because it's building your immunity. It's building oxygen in your body. It's strengthening your body. It's gently cleansing your body. It's basically making us resilient to the toxic world we're living in right now. And this is the value of the essential oil lifestyle is resilience. It's like I haven't had a cold or flu in over 15 years. I don't get sick anymore. And that's because I use essential oils. People ask me, like, Artemis, you have this glow about you. You have this, like, amazing vitality. And my secret is raw living foods and young living essential oils. And I've been doing this every day for over 15 years. And so it makes me resilient. It makes me vital. It makes me thrive. And then we can take this knowledge and transfer it to our children and empower them to thrive, too. And that's what I love 
Um, Cause we can't change the chemtrails. Don't try to fix that. Build your, your own resilience, build your own strength and become powerfully strong, healthy and resilient so you can adapt to the crazy world we live in. That's right. Yeah. And you know, I, I'm, I'm really excited that we're doing this. We're going to do it. Uh, this is, this is the first of many classes that we're going to do. This is another reason why I created women's wellness Academy is because children are our future. And if we don't change this paradigm that we're in right now, it, it goes nowhere great. So we are changing it to more positive thinking, mind, body, and spirit elements that are all incorporated, teaching moms how to live naturally and holistically. It's the really the only way that I think is the way to go. If you go the other route, you're gonna, your life is, uh, is gonna be filled with, I'm sorry, but cancer, disease, an illness. Yeah. That's the only way that I see it going. Yeah, and there's a saying in natural medicine, an, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. And so as you start incorporating the things that Nikki and I are teaching in your life, as you start learning from the 21 day course, buying the desk reference, watching more webinars, changing your lifestyle, you're preventing in your body all the diseases that our, our parents are getting. And an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. You just got to be careful who you're listening to and who you're learning from. And, you know, Nikki, I, my hat goes off to you because you bring some of the best of the best to the Women's Wellness Academy and what we're teaching today. And, you know, I have made so many mistakes in 15 years that what I've learned through all my mistakes is how to use essential oils constructively, easily, and effectively. And that's what I provide in the e-course, the 20-day e-course for people who join is, is all the shortcuts, all the simple, safe, and effective ways of getting the oils in your lifestyle, preventing disease, but also not only preventing disease, promoting wellness. Because that's what, you know, what it's really about. It's, it's about being well. It's about being vibrant and healthy. And then if you get a tummy ache, or if you get a back ache, or if you have a uh, cold or flu, we have an oil for that. We have a quick, effective solution. And then if you don't know the answer, you can go to one of my videos on my YouTube channel. Um, and our YouTube channel is, let me uh, bring that to everyone's attention, is Green Living with Essential Oils. And so for continuing education, definitely subscribe to our YouTube channel and get more information from YouTube, from Green Living with Essential Oils. And then also I encourage you to sign up, get your kit, bit.ly forward slash join with Nikki J. That's B-I-T dot L-Y forward slash join with Nikki J. And then you'll get the 21 day course and you'll get all of that training uh, plus 30 minutes with me. Um, so it's a, it's a value that's over $300. It's like yes. $250 value. And it, it really is, is priceless value because you can't put a price on your health because without your health, you are nothing. You're absolutely nothing. You cannot be happy, sick. Um, you, you really, you have to be healthy in order to really receive life as much as it's giving. Yeah. So, Here, say, that again. say that again. I want to hear that again. <laughs> I don't even know. You said, you said you have to be healthy in order to receive life as much as, as, much as it's giving. Life. Yeah. And that's really important for mothers because mothers are such caregivers and givers that they sometimes overlook the value of receiving life. You know, starting your day with a melon or a fruit smoothie infused with essential oils, taking time to breathe in some essential oils before you start your your day and just receiving that nutrition, that breath of life is so important for our moms so they can fill their well and have plenty of, of water to give their family. Yeah, that's another uh, webinar for <laughs> that we should go over because there's so many moms who are, who are thirsting for love and for to, to fill up their life because they're depleted 
Well, let's just be honest. Children take a lot of uh, out of us and mm -hmm. life can take a lot of, out of us. So if we know how to give back to ourselves, then it's, it just it feels amazing once we're, our buckets are filled and we're able to give more than what we receive once our buckets are filled and overflowing. Yeah. You know, I learned this the hard way, Nikki, because I've been in practice as a health coach and a detoxification specialist. I've, you know, I, I served thousands of people at the Tree of Life. I worked 80 hours a week for two years under Dr. Gabriel Cousins. And I, I got really close to burnout. And then I moved to Austin and became an entrepreneur. And you know how that is. You can, you, know, you can burn out very easily. So I, yeah. these practices I, I teach in the webinar night, I do. Because it's how I fill my well. You know, like I serve, I love serving my community and bringing health everywhere I go. That's my passion, it's my purpose. I live it, I breathe it, I teach it. But if I don't receive first with my morning prayers, with my structured water and smoothies, with my evening rituals of cedarwood and lavender, if I don't do this, I get depleted because I'm giving more than I receive. So there's this natural ebb and flow that we all get to learn. We get to learn how to receive. That's and right. How to receive life. Just like you said, it was beautiful. It's like if you, if you want to have health, learn to receive life as much as you're giving life. And the oils are a powerful way to, to receive that breath of life and also even receive more nutrition because the essential oils in our smoothies and in our soups and in our salad dressings, they increase nutrient transport. They increase digestion and assimilation of our nutrients. Um, so I'd love to come back and do this again. We're getting close to the hour here. Um, and I'd love to come back and do this again. So I'm going to present some ideas and opportunities of what we can teach and continue this because we had over 200 people register for the webinar. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Almost, I, almost two. I think we had over 250. Yeah. So that, that's a, that's a really good turnout in my book. And it really tells me how many people are needing this information. And so when you go ahead and you join, um, let me give you that, let's share that bit.ly one more time, bit.ly slash join with Nikki J, okay, bit.ly slash join with Nikki J. You're going to get the two incredible bonuses, that is the 30 minutes with Artemis himself giving you such extraordinary coaching, and then the 21-day um, E-course. E-course. Thank you very much. And then you get that right away. Once you sign up, Artemis will see it. You get it right away. And you can start using the benefits um, immediately. So I encourage everybody to go to that site, order your um, oils. If you would like to reach out to me, you could reach me at Nikki at NikkiJensen.com. Email me. Let's mm -hmm. chat. Um, because I love talking about this stuff. And if you, Oh, and uh, one more thing. We had a person from Canada ask about like duty taxes and custom taxes and all that stuff. Um, if you're in another country and you're watching young living has five distribution centers, they've got a Canadian distribution center. So if you're in Canada, when you sign up, you sign up in the Canadian website and you get products shipped from Canada directly from the Canadian distribution center, which saves you time and money. Also, there's a distribution center in Europe, in Australia, and also e East Asia. Um, there's a Perfect. whole distribution center. So if you're, anywhere, if you're anywhere in the world, you can get the oils and get started. So great. That takes care of that. Mm -hmm. um, there will be a replay. I will get that out to you as soon as possible. Um, and you'll be able to enjoy that replay for 24 hours. Um, you will want to listen to this again because there are so many nuggets that were given away that you will definitely want to uh, listen to this again. Um, but you will only really have the 24 hours to enjoy. So thank you so much, everybody, for your time. Thank you, Artemis. You are amazing. Mm -hmm. I appreciate you more than you know. And um, Again, if anybody has any other questions, you can email me, Nikki, at NikkiJensen.com. Bye, everybody. Have a good night. Thank you so much.